Guys, it's Crazy Craft here, and welcome to a new video. And today, uh, TU28 has came out. So what I'm gonna do is read the change log list, and uh, yeah, so it is a bug fix update. So this is what it has: uh, optimized water rendering, uh, fix for some instability when adding and removing players from a game, fix for particle effects not displaying at high altitudes, uh, fill, fix for an issue for the fuel meter in a furnace could re be reset when using a lava bucket, fix for ingredient adding to a beacon interface with the loss entering or leaving the end or the nether, fix for an issue when renaming a world, saving quickly loading the world, fix an issue where the tick rate in a chunk would run too fast when the chunk was unloaded and reloaded, fix for enable fl and flying host option call it causing healing to revert to classic mode, fix for issue with a potion of swiftness, not working for split screen players, fix for can build and mind privileges, stopping players uh, using potions, fix for uh, can build and mind privileges, stop players equipping armor from the hotbar, fix for putting out fires with buckets of water making the wood breaking sound. Uh, fix an issue where with iron golems trying to give a flower to a villager but the flower not being present. Fix for a problem with the water flickering at a distance with the usual using natural texture pack. Uh, fix for a problem unlocking the enchanter achievement when using classic crafting. Fix an issue where low opacity settings would cause the ender dragon wither health bars to be displayed constantly and constantly so that is it you guys so if you guys enjoyed this video please do leave a like comment down below and yeah i'll see you guys later and remember be crazy yeah.